Bel Canto. Set in an unspecified South American country, the story begins at a birthday party thrown at the country's vice presidential home in honor of Katsumi Hosokawa, the visiting chairman of a large Japanese company and opera enthusiast. As a not so subtle pretext to get Hosokawa to invest in the country, famous American soprano Roxanne Koss is scheduled to perform as the highlight of the party. Near the end of the party, members of a terrorist organization break into the house, intending to take the president of the country hostage. When they realize the president is not in attendance, the terrorist group decides to take the entire party hostage. After determining they have too many hostages, the terrorists decide to release all of the hostages except those they deem most likely to return a large ransom. Two major romantic relationships develop as the standoff drags on and serve as the backdrop to the rest of the story. The first is between Koss and Hosokawa, who develop a deep bond even though they do not speak each other's language and thus cannot communicate verbally. The second relationship is between the translator Jan and the young terrorist Carmen, who must keep their love a secret. The two lovers meet in the china closet every night. At the end of the novel, the government breaks into the house and kills all the terrorists. All of the hostages are freed except for Hosokawa, who dies in the struggle. In an epilogue that takes place some years later, former hostages Simon Thibault and his wife meet with Jen and Roxanne, who are getting married in Italy. 